we will share with you 10 things toxic parents say that can affect a child's life. I hope you didn't experience this. Number 1. You're not good enough. The most toxic thing a parent can say to their child is that they are not good enough. It is damaging on many levels and will affect the child's entire life. It causes low self-esteem and insecurity and often leads to depression and anxiety. The child will be afraid of failure in all areas of life because they don't think they can succeed without the parent's approval. If you have experienced this kind of treatment from either of your parents, you must remember it's a lie. Still, it can make you believe something is wrong with you, which is invalid. I know it's hard to overcome your traumas from childhood, but you can start by believing you are good enough for anything in this world and deserve to live your life the way you want it to be. You don't have to be a victim of your past. You can change it and break free. You can change your life and create what you want in this world. Number 2. You're stupid. What do you usually feel when your parents say you're stupid? Do you take it by heart or pass it on as your parents? way of expressing stress. Either way, you are the one who's losing here. Parents are supposed to protect and love their children, but most parents aren't supposed to be one. You always expect your mother and father to speak to you with warmth and concern, but reality will strike you harshly and make you realize they are the ones who don't accept you for who you are. For them, if your friend gets to overtake you in the top spot, you are stupid. You think that you will only get called like that by your bullies in school, but no. The ones who are supposed to be by your side are the ones who scarred you for life. Number 3. You don't belong here. Is it alright to feel depressed when the one who brought you into this world says you don't belong here? I say your feelings are valid if you are expressing that right now. After all, there is no handbook on how to be a good parent. Some may have tried to write it, but all parents are different. Parents make mistakes most of the time. That is why they need to find their way in their parenting life. The thing is that most parents' mistakes are too hurtful for a child or even a teenager to bear. Their children will shatter into pieces while carrying the weight of not getting accepted by their parents at one point. It only takes once for them to say you don't belong here. Number 4. You don't mean anything to me. The words, you don't mean anything to me from your parents, will hurt more than a gunshot wound. It is something you will hold on to throughout your life. Even when your toxic parent gets better, you'll still remember that moment and recount it in detail. That is why there will be no questions about why you find it hard to open up to others. I mean, having the first heartbreak you'll ever have from your founding relationship will cause you to doubt every people. It might be challenging, but give yourself a chance to see your worth. If you don't get it from your parents, other people might be able to provide you with the love you long to have. Don't lose hope. Number 5. I'm disappointed in you. A child's dreams are simple. To impress their parents. Believe me or not, you also have that dream. As a result, you are willing to do everything just to make them proud of you. Which is why hearing them say they are disappointed in you will destroy you. These words will cause you to think they are not enough, pushing you to give it up because you'll never be like your cousin whom your parents adore, or your sibling who dances with grace. Eventually, you'll realize that you are not their favorite, which is why you will never get your parents' favor. At the same time, you stumble on your two left feet. Number 6. You can't do anything right. Parents who constantly criticize your every move are the ones who can't do anything right. 
That is why they let themselves breathe from the weight of their worries and failures. Some parents will treat their children like shock absorbers, deflecting their feelings toward their children. Toxic parents do not protect their children. Their top priority will always be themselves. It's no use to prove yourself to someone who doesn't even acknowledge their wrongdoings. Number 7. You should give up now because you won't succeed anyway. Parents are the ones who should lift their children to reach their dreams. But nowadays, they always use practicality to shut down their children's dreams. The worst thing a child will ever experience when chasing their dream is to hear their parents say that they should give up because they won't succeed anyway. If you have experienced this firsthand, you'll know how painful it is when your parents don't trust you with your dreams. And most of the time, you will get forced to listen to your parents when they say you should take this path, not your silly dreams. Eventually, killing your potential and passion for your goals. Number 8. You are the worst child in the world. It's a slap in the face when your parents say you are the worst child in the world. Especially if you're not doing anything wrong. Toxic parents will let their anger out toward their children. Much more if the pregnancy is unplanned. If your parents are acting this way, do you understand the underlying meaning of it? In truth, they feel bad for themselves and can't take it when they see you. You might be the constant reminder of their mistakes and failures. And they can't do anything else but say hurtful things toward you to console themselves. Number 9. I don't have time for you right now. As a child, you need your parents to be as close to perfect as possible. If they're not, your childhood can feel like a waiting game for when you get out of the house and move on with your own life. But what if you don't have that option? What if you can't leave home because of your parents? That's a situation many young adults find themselves in today. As a result, they will never escape the prison that their parents have created for them. Constant waiting will take a toll on you and eventually dry you out of your energy. Quality time is essential, but most parents don't prioritize it. Number 10. I wish you were never born. It might be hard to accept, but the truth is that some parents hate the existence of their children. However, it is never right to jump to conclusions and see them as evil. Some parents might have gone through a traumatic experience that made them hate their children, like getting raped and burying the child of their rapist. It can also be because they got left behind by their partner for someone else. Your parents might have cursed at you many times, but hearing them say they wish you were never born hurts, even when they have valid reasons for it. After all, you expect them to be loving and kind toward you because that's what they must be doing. But we must remind ourselves that most parents aren't perfect. Some are lost, insecure, and distressed due to the possibility of getting abused earlier in their age. The worst is that their parents might have been the ones who inflicted pain on them. And as a result, they become the perfect image of their abusive parents and follow in their footsteps. But you know what's scary when parents abuse their child verbally, emotionally, and physically? It doesn't end in their child it will get passed on to generations. And the cycle of abuse produces a broken generation, which you might be a part of now.